Welcome to Let's Play Forza Motorsport 4, Part 55. And I bought this Citroen DS3, or DualShock 3 from the dealer shit. Because, uh, well, that's what I'm going to use for our next series. And we're actually going to do more than one race in the series. Holy fuck. For it's a, uh, not a one-make race, but it's a manufacturer spec series. The Citroen so showcase, so... Limited to cit the three Citroens in this game, at least the three that I have. And it's going to be an eight-car race. And Johansson and Russo are dumbasses for staying in E-Class, basically. So here's our four tracks we're going to be racing at. Including the Top Gear Circuit, Silverstone National, Camino Viejo. And we're going to start off at the Ladera Test Track. Reverse course for three laps. Off we go. Alrighty. Attempt two at this, because, um, this man, this little fucker here. God, he's an asshole. If I was a wrestler, what gimmick would I have? Ugh. Uh, I don't know. I want to, like, my default answer would be. Look decay thing, you know. But um I, I don't know. I'd want to do something, definitely something fun and, and completely my own. Cause creative freedom is like the single best thing in wrestling. Like, yes, there are some people who are, you know, have characters given to them, and they work perfectly with them. And then there's others that, you know, create their characters, characteristics and stuff. And those are usually the best wrestlers. Just saying. So, yeah. Basically, I'd be either, like, an edgy, demonic guy, or fucking, I don't know. A silly, baby-faced nerd. Ooh, no, my gimmick would be the Stig. No. <laughs> I just come out in a fucking full fire suit and a helmet. Am I using a wheel? No, I'm just using a standard 360 controller. Alright, I need to work my way around Rossi Miller somehow here. So far, I'm not having any luck finding an overtake spot. Here's an okay opportunity. Alright, it's Scotty dive time. The power of McLaughlin compels me. That was a very, very bad setup for that hairpin. Get back to Rossi. Alright. It's Scotty time. Oh ho! Oh ho! Come on, I got this. Rough him up. Rough him up. Yeah! Got him. Oh, uh, shit. Beautiful. Oh, yeah. And then there's Johansson and Russo. I forgot about them. Fucking dumbasses. It's like, oh, let's just keep our cars in E-Class. Her, her. Okay, well, there's the first race down. Just uh, three more to go after that. And, ooh, infinity bonus. Alright. Alright, time for race two at Camino Viejo. De Monstra. Whoa. Whoa. 
My fucking chat window has, um, it's having a big sad. Need to fix that here in a sec. Oh, we're doing the internet, the uh, the, the second short circuit, the middle circuit. Thought we were doing the full circuit. No, nope, we're wrong. I was wrong. Okay. Oh, there we go. Fixed it. It fixed itself. Hooray. Okay. Well, um. Let's work on hopefully winning this. Because, you know, winning is cool. Don't know if you know, but winning is pretty cool. I'm not gonna lie. Oh, shit. Okay, three to go. Catch Evans and Rossi up here. Ooh, how you doing, Evans? Holy shit. Okay, I need to fucking scroll my chat down. There we go. Fixed it. Favorite band? Favorite band is Chevelle. Which is weird, because, like, you know, I'm crazy. Well, that happened. Okay. That's not how you do that turn correctly, but uh, I guess it worked for the overtake, but, um... It's weird, because, you know, I'm into crazy, silly, edgy metal, but yet, yeah, my favorite band is Chevelle. Because, fucking fuck. The band is named after the car. Because, like, the father of, well, the entire band at the time owned a Chevelle, or his favorite car was a Chevelle, or something like that. It's like, hey, let's name our band after it. Fuck it. And then they went on to make amazing fucking music. For the past like decade and a half, and it's a grand old time. So I'm just kind of uh fucking this turn up. I was gonna say I was just kind of going around the outside of Rossi here, but nope. That is not correct. Was Mike Bennett doing anything in TNA? Uh, the last thing he did was kind of be very drunk during the whole uh, Braxton Sutter Laurel Van Ness wedding angle. He wasn't really doing anything like feuding with anybody. I don't think. Okay, I need to make this pass in Rossi here. Alright, we're going for fucking Scotty. Exceptionally wide, come on. Alright, we're good. We got the run off the turn. Or we gotta get enough run. Rossi couldn't capitalize, and we get the win. From another last turn pass. Hooray. And then there's Johansson and Russo. Uh, fuck. Alright, there we go. So, two races down, two races to go. Up to level three for Citroen, and let's go to race three. All right, time for race three around the Top Gear track. So why not? But it's not the normal uh, normal route. We're doing the, uh, the, I think this is the Eastern course, if I remember correctly. Of course, we start with Gambon, just immediately into Gambon. Just fucking why not? So, hooray. I'm already up to third, going for second here. Oh, getting along 
inside Rossi. I uh, had to scratch my nose, couldn't turn. Alright, and there we go. Got a badge for mileage on the top gear track, hooray. Your title. Probably end badge. Oh, hello, where am I going? That's, that's not where the road is. That was incredibly fucking wide ass runway, and yet I still go off into the grass. I am a master of car. I tell you what. Alright, well, this is gonna be piss easy. Unlike the last two races. Right, AI sucks around here. Good to know. Fuck my ass. Apparently I suck at Gambon, going this way. What a shock. Oh, okay. I'll go fuck myself, this is not correct, uh... Pro tip, don't go wide. It takes longer to go around the track. I keep breaking too early and then not simultaneously not enough for camp on. Fuck me. I got one more chance to get it right. What is with me? I cannot keep this car on the road for some goddamn reason. It's not because it's difficult to, it's just because I'm shitting myself or something. I don't even know. Just look at all the cars. Okay, one more lap to go. Oh, I didn't go off into the grass this time at least, so that's good. <laughs> Off the track he goes. Uh, oh, there he is. Didn't take the AI driver long to rejoin. Ended up winning by seven seconds. Wow. Nice. The motor fell all the way back to six. I wonder what happened to him. I don't know. But he did not have a good race. He probably got some damage, judging by his best lap time. Who knows? But there we go. Third race down. One more to go here in the, uh, the Citroen Showcase, whatever the fuck this was called. Citroen Showcase, so, uh, let's go. Alright, here we go. Final race, Silverstone National Circuit. For three laps, so let's get into the interior car. Let's go. Me, pardon me. Oh, Miller and Rossi uh, having a little disagreement there. Allow me to insert myself into this situation. Is the th dual shock three wide? Oh god! Who's going to win this battle? It's going to be me. Okay, sweet. Well, that was interesting. That was quite the uh, kerfuffle there. OK, 
Okay, I don't really need second gear here. So I'll just not use second gear there. Oh god. Keep her on the road. I'll see lurking. Oh wow, he got around that turn much better than me, but looks like I got the much better exit. Gear. Continue staying in third gear. Oh, please, car. Alright, final lap. And Rossi only 0.7 behind me. I tried carrying too much speed. Frig. Hello, Rossi. I really should not be giving you the room here, but... It's okay. How you doing? What's up, my dudes? Why is this Mizzou in third? He needs to fuck off to the Shadow Realm. I don't know why the Shadow Realm, but... It's, you know. Oh god. That was, this is a very bad ending sequence. It was a very, very bad ending sequence. But it doesn't matter because I still win the race. Just not by much. Oh, I didn't even get the fastest lap. Damn. Damn. Oh well. But uh, there we go. Unless Johansson Russo crossed the line. Fucking idiots. Anyways, I win, and our last infinity bonus, which is level 5 with Citroen. There we go, that is the Citroen showcase complete. Hooray, I did it. So there we go, our first multi-race series done, finally, so uh... Yeah, that'll end that, so stay tuned uh, for more Forza 4 and more racing next time. Ah.